Hello guys and welcome to Red's List once again. Now, where I'm at right now, it's getting a little cold. Some parts of the country are still perfect to go boating. And anytime you got a lot of people going boating, you got a lot of people that are stupid, that are ignorant, that have never boated before, or that are drunk, wasted, not paying attention, whatever, and they create these lovely pictures just for us. Take a look at these boating fells. All right, when I was looking for pictures of this, I saw a lot of them like this. I've been out in my boat quite a few times. I have never ran up on rocks. Ever. I take that back. I did get pushed up against rocks because my motor failed and I was in the middle of the storm and I had no control over the boat. I actually had to jump out of the boat to push it away from the rocks and beach it in the sand. Other than that, I've never ran over rocks and I definitely have never done this. That looks like that takes extreme talent. Probably scared the hell out of them. Same thing right here. How do you run up on shore that far? What were you doing that you didn't see that? I bet I know what you were doing. You had one of these on board. That's what you were paying attention to. Because for you to do this, you're paying attention to something else other than what's going on in front of the boat. You're looking for something else that was going on in the boat. That's what you were doing. Same thing with this guy. And how fast were you going for that thing to go about, what, a third of the way through the boat? You're hauling ass at that point. That takes talent. I bet that hurt. It probably threw him out of the boat. Again, probably not paying attention to what's going on in front of him. He's paying attention to something else. I can see how that would make you lose your attention span to everything else around you. Pay attention to the boat. Pay attention to what's in front of you. So you don't end up like that. And if you're going to jump out of the boat, don't do this. <laughs> Whatever you do. My God, that is a wedgie from hell. Do not ever do that. I'd like to have seen the actual video on that if somebody caught it. I bet that was funny as hell. <laughs> this one too. <laughs> okay, so, yeah, there's cleats on the side of the boat so you can tie up to the dock. Generally don't want to hang your freaking underwear on it or your shorts, bathing suit, whatever. That is a wedgie from hell. I bet that hurt like hell. Oh my God. Don't ever do that. Whatever you do, do not try that at home. This would freak your ass out. You're sitting at home watching TV and a freaking boat comes through your house. Uh, I mean, it's. I, I'm guessing... I'm guessing somebody was pulling it down the road and it came unlatched from the truck. Crashed to the house. I've never seen that. I hope I never do. I bet that scared the hell out of somebody. <laughs> Here's another view of it. Same thing. That had to have been scary as hell sitting inside your house if there was anybody home at the time. And just, bam! Freaking boat. <laughs> this is another one. Guys, this is why you use straps on your boat. If you don't strap your boat down and you get on the brakes, your boat doesn't stop. This is what happens when you don't use straps. Use the straps. You're going to make a list like this. Matter of fact, go ahead. Don't use straps. I need more pictures to make more lists. So go ahead. <laughs> I have no idea what happened here. I have no idea how this could have happened. I don't get it. I can't see how it could have happened. I'm absolutely lost on this. And if you look on this one, where the arrow's pointing, there's a guy there. I don't see anybody at the helm of this boat. I don't know who was supposed to be driving it. But this guy's hanging on for dear life. No, and I wish I could have saw the video to it. I couldn't find it. I was going to get it. Um, I have no idea. I really wish I could have seen that one. <laughs> Read the caption on this one. F this boat. I can run faster. And if you look at it, it's perfect, perfect timing on the picture. Dude's pulling at Jesus and running across the water. He's like, F this boat. I can run faster. He's just taking off. That's funny as hell. Oh, my God. This is always a fear if you're out on the boat on a holiday weekend or something when everybody's out there. That's why I don't go out on the lake during holidays because there's idiots out there. And you see things like this, and I really hope it didn't hit the people that are in the other boat. 
because that could be bad. So I don't want to laugh at it too much just in case somebody might have actually got killed during this. But it's a great action shot of a boating accident. Just don't do this at home, guys. Pay attention. Quit looking at these when you have them on your boat and pay attention to what's going on. I know these are nice to look at. Don't get me wrong. I'd be looking at it too, but stop the boat, anchor, then pay attention to that. <sighs> and don't do this. When you're coming up to dock the boat, you're supposed to stop the boat and tie it to the dock. Not use the boat for a round and <laughs> jump up through the roof of the dock. Yeah, like this one here, man, I hope nobody was hurt in this, but they literally just launched up the top of this boat. How fast do you have to be going to hit that? And were they paying attention to something like the other guys were or not? Because how do you not see that guy, Janik, I can't even talk right now. How do you not see that gigantic boat in front of you? That is absolutely insane that you didn't see that and you ran over that and launched up on top of it. <laughs> we all know how this is going to end. You know what? There's a guy there at the controls of this boat. Just put it in gear, ease the boat forward, help your buddy out. Unless you're just wanting the picture and you want <laughs> to do the splits and fall in the water, then by all means, go ahead, just sit there, let it happen. The only bad thing about it is that ice chest he's holding is going to float. He's not. That thing's going to hit first. He's going to bang his face into it. It's probably going to be the end of your buddy. As it is, that's the end of this video. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe right there. Hit it. Subscribe on it. And then if you want to watch another video, it's right there. Always. Go ahead. Watch that one. Hit the subscribe button. And then watch another one of my videos. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you next time. Good night.